Welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a really simple video on how to insert an image into your document in Word. So I've just got a demonstration document here and I'm simply going to go to insert pictures, click on the drop down and you have a number of different options here. So normally if you want your own personal pictures you will select picture from file but for this demonstration I'm going to go to stock images and I'm just going to select this image here and just click insert. Now when your image is inserted into Word generally it will be placed anywhere on the Word document and it will generally splat across the page and you'll panic because it's ruined everything but just select the image make sure you're on picture format go to wrap text click on the drop down and once again, you have a number of different options. So depending on how you want your pictures to sit in your document will depend on which one you select. So tight here, you select that one. If I reduce the size of the picture, you can see that the text will actually wrap around your image. Alternatively, if you want top and bottom, it will simply mean that your text will be at the top and bottom of your image. And then you have other alternatives to put your image behind your text or in front of your text. So if we go back up to tight and I'm just going to show you how you can change the spacing between your picture and your text. So as you can see, if I move this picture around, the text is very, very close to my image. If I go back up to wrap text and I go down to more layout options at the bottom here, you've got an option distance from text. So let's just put in one centimeter for all of these options, but you can fully customize this and put in your own values and then click OK. Now you can see we have a one centimeter gap between our image and all of the text. Obviously you can resize your image, but if you actually want to crop it, select the image, go to picture format, go to crop, click on the drop down. You can either select crop or you can go to crop to shape and you can select from any of the shapes or you can select an aspect ratio. So for this demonstration, I'm going to select square and then I can move this image around in that selection square. If I want to reduce the size of this, I must hit the shift key. Otherwise it will no longer be a square and then I can reduce the size of that square if I wish to do so and then just press enter. So I hope that's helped you today. If it has, please like and subscribe and have a great day.